All right, what up guys? Today I'm gonna talk to you guys about AI Apply. From what I know, there are lots of people out, out right now, you know, looking for jobs, trying to find jobs, and the job market is too difficult to navigate. I mean, I understand. So I'm gonna review an AI tool that pretty much helps you when it comes to getting a job, finding a job, and the whole nine yards. So AI Apply, has a bunch of things. So they help you with your job interview. So you pretty much go in there and they'll transcribe and give you, you know, um, answers to questions and stuff like that. They have a resume builder, cover letter generator, interview answer bu uh, buddy, auto apply and job board. So we're gonna try out as many features as we can try out. I don't wanna waste you guys time, so let's get right into it. So when you log in right here, and by the way, this is a free trial. If you want access to the free trial, I have access to it in the description below. And once you log in, you can log in with Google or use your own email. You'll be asked to either upload a resume or you'll be asked to connect LinkedIn. So I'm just going to connect my LinkedIn and I'm going to catch you guys. All right now, so I've put in my LinkedIn and so I'm just going to click on continue and it's going to get my LinkedIn data and then upload it. Let's just wait. Okay, so it's been able to give a bunch of stuff from here. Experience level, um, let's see, media, minimum salary, 70 grand, job type, full time, read everything. Okay, this is pretty good so far. And then click on continue. Now, you can go ahead and give it a job description. And so I'm just going to give job description. So what type, what do I want this to be tailored to? Let's say uh, I want it to be tailored to startups that are seeking digital marketing specialists. Okay, and then you can go ahead and make this either informal, semi-casual, semi-formal, formal. So I just want it to be neutral. I'm just gonna click on generate. Now, in order for you to see the resume created for you, you have to upgrade to the paid plans. And then the follow-up emails, you also have to upgrade to the paid plans. But if you take a look at the cover letter, you'll be able to see it right here. I'm excited to apply for digital marketing specialist position on your startup with over six years as you can see it takes directly from my linkedin and then goes in here and populates this pretty cool now let's go back to the job hub so it has this right here now if we go over to uh, resumes you can come in here and create a resume so we have using your saved resume what is your desired job title let's just say um digital marketer that's a very popular one these days so i'm just going to keep going with this one okay so right here on the side, you can see it. So it tells you what will be in your resume, digital marketer, choose some an example.com. Obviously, you can always edit all this, put in your LinkedIn URL. And then it comes in and gives you a professional summary. It's going to give you stuff from your jobs and everything like that. Okay. And then it just adds it. So it adds the job description and stuff. You can always AI generate to add more. And it just keeps going and going and going and going. And then it takes directly from here. Also, this does for your school too adds that in skills. It gives you skills, social ma uh, media marketing, content strategy, SEO, WordPress, Adobe Photoshop, communication, things of that nature. So you can then take this and then tell your own resume. Or if you upgrade, you get to see, you know, an actual resume fully uh, built out for you. So it's a pretty good tool on that end. And at the end, I'm going to show you what the pricing looks like to see whether it's worth it for you or not, because, you know, I'm not you. Then also for the same thing too, we cover letters, just like I showed you guys at the beginning, we showed you a cover letter that was tailored directly from your own uh, LinkedIn profile. You can also put in your own resume and then we'll tailor a cover letter from that. So you can open and see it or you can download it as a PDF. Let's open and look at it. So this is what it looks like. I'm excited you know, to apply for the digital marketing uh, specialist position and everything. If I put, I don't like it, for example, save changes, save changes. You can come in here and from putting stuff like I don't like it or I like it, it helps their AI algorithm understand different things. So you kind of train the AI. So by you picking whether you like it or not. So open. And once you've sent that message, it will be able to tell. Now you can always come in here. Let me say I delete this one. Okay. I delete that cover letter because I don't want it. And I create a cover letter using your saved resume. So job description, I like to tailor it to. Let's say I want to tailor it to um, social media marketing at Google. And I'm just trying to make it this way. And let's say I want to make it uh, semi-casual. I'm just going to click on generate. 
So now you can see it. Hi there, I'm excited to throw my heart hat in the ring for the social media marketing role at Google with over six years and everything. As you can see, it's very it's semi casual. In my recent role, I grew my likes and everything. Pretty cool. And you can always save changes or whatever. Now, it also has uh, job interviews. So you can create a mock interview here. So it trains you because a lot of people, from what I know, tend to get very nervous when it comes to being in like professional interviews, especially like at professional jobs and stuff. So if I just click on create interview, what's the job title? Let's just say, as it says, backend software engineer, let me just say backend software engineer. I don't have it in description for this. So I'm just gonna click on generate. So these are some questions that it gives you. You will have to upgrade to view the answers. So it says, can you explain the role and responsibilities of a backend software engineer? And you, you have to upgrade to give the answers. And for you to upgrade, it will be $29 a month. So you can use this stuff for a limited time, 50% discount. Typically, it was like 50 bucks before, but now they increase it to 58. Now they're giving a discount at 29 bucks a month. You can also have it at lifetime. So pay $199 and never pay again, ever again. Quarterly, $19 a month. So it totally depends on you. And you'll be able to see certain questions that you'll be asked at the interview. So can you explain the role and responsibilities of a backend software engineer? If I were you, you know what I'll do? I'll take these questions. I'll go to chat GPT, put these questions in there and say, um, answer it from a first from a first person perspective. And then chat GPT will be able to give you a sentence. You can also upload your resume to chat GPT and tell chat GPT to give you answers based on that. What programming languages and frameworks are you most proficient in for backend development. So these are the type of questions they'll typically ask you. Explain a situation where you use a new technology to improve a project's outcome. So it's a pretty good tool to aid you in um, your job interview, preparing for jobs and everything. They also have a tool. I'm not gonna get too into this one because it takes a whole nother video for this, where you pretty much come in here, okay? And what happens is you upload their Chrome extension to your uh, Chrome browser. So when you're on Google Meet, Microsoft Teams, or, or Zoom, and a person is asking you a question, let's say you have the interviewer asking you questions, it's able to transcribe it immediately and answer immediately. So it's almost like uh, it, it picks up the questions immediately and starts giving answers. So as long as your resume is uploaded here, or your LinkedIn is able to then use that as a ways to answer it. And then as you're just looking at the screen, you're able to answer the interviewer's questions. So it's a pretty good, cool tool. I showed you guys um, what it looks like when you upgrade it. Monthly, 29, quarterly, 19, and lifetime, 199. So it's a good tool for those of you out there that you know have problems with applying for jobs, telling your resumes, cover letters, and all that. In my opinion, I would say this is a kind of tool that you pay for and you hope to get your, your return back You know, once you get a job. But other than that, I say it's a pretty good tool. You want this type of tool to get a job and uh, yeah, use it that way. Um, for some reason, the screen itself is not showing, but they typically have an auto apply. I don't know if I can access it. Yeah, but they typically have an auto apply, but the UI is not all that right now. And the auto apply itself will go ahead and apply for jobs for you automatically. Obviously, you have to pay for that. And yeah, it's a good tool. That's, I want you guys to tell me how you feel about AI apply in the uh, comment section below. And as always, I have access to the best AI tools that you guys can use. Link to it in the description below, and I'm gonna catch you guys next week.